Colorado, where our goal is to make it great. Today I'm coming to you from my bathroom. I've got a nice project I want to share with you. That's a toilet paper holder, shaped as an outhouse, made out of Colorado beetle kill pine. Stick with me and I'll show you how it's done. Let's go to the workshop. Here we are in the shop. Well, outside the shop. It's a nice day, and why not work outside when it's nice? Because you know in Colorado, the weather changes pretty quickly. Before we get started, a quick note about shop safety. Always be careful. You're a maker, not a breaker. This here is some raw beetle kill pine taken from the Colorado high country. To many people, this looks like a piece of wood. Not to us makers, though. We see a blank canvas. And it's our job to convert something like this into something like this. Stick with me, and I'll show you how. For this project, you're going to need you're going to need some screws, some wood, safety glasses, and a measuring tape. <laughs> yeah, I know that's toilet paper, but I use it as a measuring tape. Let me show you how. I know how wide I need to make the bottom of the outhouse. And if I stack three toilet papers on top of each other, I know how high. To cut the wood, you're going to want to use your tape measure and cut accordingly. You'll see I cut the roof at uh, about this angle. You can do the same. And the crescent moon, professionally done by me, was done with a Dremel tool. It's probably going to take some practice for you to get something quite that good. But practice up. That's the way we do it as makers. Oh, and don't mind the this piece of wood down here. That's a cutting board I made. That's a project for another time. Be patient and I'll show you. Here's a close-up of today's project. As I said earlier, it is made out of Colorado beetle kill pine. If you live in Colorado, you know there's a lot of that around. I did stain it. And I made it to look rustic because, after all, it is a bathroom. That's where all the magic happens. So there you have it. Thanks for spending your time with me. After you've assembled everything and painted your outhouse, you're ready to put the toilet paper right inside there. So when you're ready to get a jump on taking a dump, think Colorado Makers. Bye-bye. So there you have it. That's how a Colorado Maker, who's making it great, makes an outhouse for the basement bathroom. That was a bright idea.